Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you are planning to build a professional online website for your makeup and beauty products, so how you can do that? Here you can see this is a professional website that is built on WordPress platform. So here you can sell beauty products and any type of other products. So just if I can open one product, here you can see how a single product looks so just customer can purchase and after that just click here view card the next click here checkout so in this way you can see this is e-commerce website where customer can purchase products and after that you can check out various other pages and categories so great these are professionally designed category pages after that if you scroll down here you can see and we have footer on the bottom after that we have a professional logo header menu and many more so let's see how we can get this to build any type of wordpress website you just need two things one is called domain so that is basically your website name and the second one is called hosting where your website files are stored in a server so here you can see these are the top famous companies so these are the hosting providers that you can compare prices so this is almost three dollar monthly and also you can check here host getter so scroll down and let's check these are the hosting packages that you can select one of these just here you can select starter package and after that on the next page here you can see this is a section that you can fill out a form but before that you can just add your domain name so make sure that your domain name will be unique like if we add Amazon so you will not be able to purchase this domain because this name is already taken and after that just you can scroll down here you can see these are some options that you can add and after that just click here and make payment after that you can just go here and sign in to portal after that in dashboard here you can see in hosting so this is the hosting package that I have purchased after that just click here on manage and after that just click here settings scroll down here you can see these are the name servers that we need to connect in our domain so that our domain and hosting will be connected so just I can copy this and I have purchased hosting from this company hostinger.pk here you can see this is the domain name latest fullhdmovies.com just click here on manage and after that here you can see in name servers just click here change name servers after that scroll down here you can see these are the current name servers just you can replace with your own name servers and after that just I can copy this second one add here after that just click here on save button in this way you can connect your domain with your hosting after that the next step is just go to cPanel and we need to install WordPress in our domain so now you can see the cPanel has loaded and after that scroll down here you can see these are various features that you can use and learn step by step after that just click here app installer so this is a basic tutorial that you can create your own website here you can see these are some platforms that you can use just click here the first one WordPress after that scroll here and click here on install now after that here you can see for SSL security you can just add HTTPS and normally it is used HTTP after that you can select one of domains that you want to install WordPress after that you can select WordPress Perian and after that if you get WP here just you can remove this one the next you can add here website login detail username password your own email address after that here you can add site name description 
and here you can select the plugins that you want to install by default so this is important plugin if you install after that scroll down here you can select one of theme the next you can click install now button and after that wordpress will be installed so this is the way that you can install wordpress and after that let's check what we can do at this step wordpress is installed in our website so now you can see how a fresh website looks on wordpress platform in this website just we need to log in so how we can log in just add wp-admin after your domain name after that here we can add login details so now just click here on login button you can see we have logged in into our wordpress website so this is a website dashboard that how it looks after that just you can go here appearance and themes now you can see by default this theme is active and after that you can install new themes and if you want to upload any premium theme file just you can click here and upload your theme zip file after that you can select any of these free, the free themes so this is a themes library that contains thousands of wordpress themes just install and after that we can activate this theme so here you can see it takes just few seconds so just activate it and after that we need to install and upload some plugins so just click here on add new after that here you can see i want to install this plugin classic editor classic widgets and after that i want to install some more plugins really simple ssl so this is a plugin that can install ssl in your website and you can increase your website security but i already have ssl you can see this is a site lock so that means my website is secure after that you can add this one and now i can add some plugins from my laptop here you can see i have just i can select plugins from resources folder here you can see these are some plugins that i need to install so if you just need any of these plugins just you can type in the comment section and i will send you link so that you can download these premium plugins and install in your website so guys you can see how easy to design a wordpress website and how is to install and plugins in wordpress website so this is the easiest way just within few clicks you can install any of premium plugins as well as free plugins in your website all right now you can check i have installed elementor pro but i got notification so that i need to install elementor free version and after that i can select in inactive plugins just i can use bulk option select here activate click here apply so now you can see so it has activated all of plugins that are installed as you can see our website has a clean here you can see so this is very simple and we want to add some design on it here you can see this is a professional website design that we want to add in our website so to do that just go to dashboard in appearance here you can see starter templates just click here and after that here you can see these are hundreds of themes that you can add according to your business and after that here we can search with a keyword for example i remember template name so i can type this one you can add any of the keyword that you want and after that just click here on the template so here you can add your own logo file and if you don't have any logo file just click here skip and continue after that here you can select color scheme according to your requirement so just click here you can see the design is working accordingly and after that scroll down here you can see the continue button just click here and fill out these details 
and after that scroll down just click here submit and build my website so in this way when it will go to 100% then your website will be ready to use so here you can see this is the final result and after that if you want to change this logo how you can do that just go to theme customizer and after that what you will get on this page so these are the options that you can see on the left side just click here on the header builder after that site title and logo so the next scroll down here you can see just click here on the change logo so here you can upload your own logo file and after that scroll down so here you can change this logo and scroll down so this is site icon that you can add and the next if you want to change this menu how you can do that just go here click here on menus after that you can go here this is how menu page looks so these are some menus that are created here you can see primary menu just select here and let's see so these are all menu items you can remove and add any of these so if i want to remove this one just click here and it has removed after that if you want to add another just click here and add to menu so you can see how easy to edit a wordpress website just click here on save menu and after that if you want to change this design images and buttons how you can do that just click here with edit with elementor so here you can see how the elementor website looks just click here on six dots here you can see this is section setting and you can change these options go to style tab so here you can see this is the image in the background just you can upload your own image from here and after that here you can add your own text for example best beauty collection and after that you can link the button with any page for example you want to link with shop page just copy the link and after that here you can add in a button so when someone clicks on this button that will be redirected to shop page after that scroll down here you can see these are the product section just you can change and also here you can change this text for example featured products scroll down here you can see these are some other images and section areas that if you want to change just you can do it so in this way you can build a professional design with no programming and coding skills how you can accept payments in your wordpress e-commerce website just you can go here woocommerce settings after that go to payments so now here you can add your store details your country state and scroll down here you can see by default currency is selected dollars just you can change it whatever you want after that here you can see these are by default options cash on delivery check payments direct bank transfer and just you can enable one of these and you can also enable all after that if you want to accept payments with paypal or stripe how you can do that just you need to install a plugin just you can go here plugin sections type paypal and after that here you can see these are some plugins that you can install as you can see the first plugin rating is very down just we can install the second one so it has five star ratings and active 52 installations just we can install the plugins and after that we just need to go in plugin settings here you can see just click here on settings and after that here you can see this is a button connect to paypal so just you can directly connect 
and here you can see it is loading just you can add your paypal information like login details after that it will be automatically connected so the next these are some options for manual integration just you can copy your production client id from your paypal account after that you need a secret key the next step is just you can add webhook id after that just click on save changes so this is the way that you can get your professional online store for your any type of business